Hello guys, welcome to my YouTube channel SolidWorks Tutorial. Today we gonna make an exercise video tutorial of, for my beginners friends. I gonna use SolidWorks 2020 for designing this part. First, we gonna draw the front view of the base plate of the part, and extrude. Then we will sketch the cylindrical part and extrude. Then we will sketch the back wall, and extrude for completing today's exercise. Let's start. Click on new part. Choose plain white background. Now go to the material, right click and select the desired material from the list. For this project we gonna select AISI 316. Now we gonna sketch the front view of the bottom part of the part. Right click on the front plane and choose sketch. From the sketch menu select corner rectangle command. Draw a rectangle like me. Take smart dimension command. Height is 15 millimeters. Width is 60 millimeters. Now we will remove this rectangular area. Again, take rectangle command and draw like me. Take smart dimension command. Width of this small rectangle is 30 millimeters. Distance between these two arms is 15 millimeters. Height of the rectangle is 7.5 millimeters. The sketch is fully defined. Now we take trim command, and trim this line. Press OK to complete the trim command. Now we gonna extrude the sketch. Reverse the direction. Here extrude length is 120 millimeters. Change the distance to 120 millimeters. Scroll out the mouse to zoom out. Press OK. Now we gonna make the cylindrical portion of the part. For doing that we will sketch these two circles first. Let's sketch on the back surface of the part. Left click and select sketch. Take circle command and draw two circles like this. Take smart dimension command. Diameter of the inner circle is 40 millimeters. Diameter of the outer circle is 60 millimeters. Height of the center of those circles from the bottom line is 65 millimeters. Distance of that center from this arm is 90 millimeters. The sketch is fully defined. Press OK for closing the command. Now we gonna extrude the area for making the cylinder. Go to the feature menu and choose extrude command. Reverse the direction of the extrude. Here the cylinder length is 40 millimeters. Change the extrude length into 40 millimeters. Press OK to complete the extrude command. Now we will make the back wall of the part. Again, left click on this surface and choose sketch command. Now we gonna convert the line and circle for using in this sketch. Take convert entities command and choose this line and circle. Press OK. Hold 1 the mouse scroll button and drag for rotating the part.
Now take line command and draw a tangent of the circle from the end point of the line. Do the same for this side also. Make this line tangent to the circle. Hold on control button and select the line and circle and select tangent relationship. Now take trim command and trim this part of the circle. Now go to features menu and select extrude command. This wall thickness is 20 mm. Reverse the extrude direction. Scroll in to zoom in. Select the merge result checkbox on, for merging all these three bodies, and making a single body. Congratulations! This is part which we were trying to build for my beginner's friends. Hope you liked my tutorial. If you want more SolidWorks tutorial like this, then don't forget to subscribe my channel, and press the bell icon for getting notification of new releases.